the table for one? We got a beautiful bacala salad. I'm here for, for someone. Go? I'm here for Ray. Oh, Ray, why did you say so? Ray's a beautiful man, you know what I mean? Uh, he's in the back. Thanks. Hey, Nikki! <laughs> How you doing, kid? Fine. Ah, <laughs> hey! <laughs> that Mick bastard friend of yours says you're okay. Good. That you're reliable. Yep. But can I trust you? Hmm? Why go through all this? Why stick your neck out? Why do all this work? Because I need the money. And because I can't do anything else. And because I'm good at it. Sure. And because I'm trying to find someone. Okay, maybe we can help. Let's see how we do. So anyways, I got this friend. Only the friend ain't my friend no more because he ain't getting me the vigios. Okay. Seems this guy does not respect the waste management business. Lives over in a project on Galveston near you. Name is Teddy Benavidez. Do what you gotta do. Somebody gets burnt, so be it. Fine. And you'll pay. Hey, you're kidding, I'll pay double. Good. But, you mess up, bad things are gonna happen. You know what apartment Teddy Benavides is in? No sé, I don't know no Teddy's. You sure about that? You want the last thing to come out of your mouth to be a lie? Shit, man. He's up on the top floor, apartment 151K. You have to walk the last few floors. Elevator don't go up there, they're fixing it up. T-Dog, someone's coming up. Don't know how, but he knows where your apartment is. Oh, 
Are you gonna finish me quickly? You're pathetic! Man, you got me! You're glad you messed with me? Slow, my What's this about, pendejo? You owe Ray Bocino a lot of money. You should have paid. Those putos too old. They're finished, fool. This city don't belong to them no more. I wouldn't pay them shit. Fuck off, maricón! Ah! Ah! Ted is dead. We talking about? Hey, who's he? Sorry to hear about your loss. I'll be in touch, Nikki. Patrick McCreary, I probably don't remember giving you my number or who you are. Ladies, uh, I'm sorry with the one-night stand. Hey, Brucey, what's up? Hey, Nico B. Come here, show me the love man whoa, hug time. Enough, all right. Whoa, whoa, what are we about here, you and me? I don't know. What are we about, boy? Oh, I'm an immigrant and a hired gun, and you're a steroid junkie, but we get along. No, not that stuff. That's superficial. I'm talking about the real shit. What? We're winners, man. Fucking winners. That's how we roll, brother. Bling, check. Bodies, check. <laughs> Paper, check. That's how we roll, bitches. The Boss. Are you all right? Too much bullshark testosterone up the ass? Uh, fuck you, fuck you, man. Hey, check this out. Letty! Letty! Is the bitch ready? Well, she's very shiny. Look at her, and weep tears of pure gold. Motherfuckers! Come on now, let's go show some people just how we roll. Yeah, all right, come on, get in. Start you! Shit. Pure gold, eh, big man? <laughs> Lenny, you're a fucking asshole. What is this? What is this? You two to yourself! Yeah. Well, what should I do? I mean, I need a flashy car. People are gonna think I'm a no-nut bullshitter if I fail to deliver here. How about Steve's car? Yes. I'll call him on the way. Nico, can you drive us to Freetown Avenue and Willis? Yeah. Come on. Let's roll! Bitches! Woo! Uh, 
Nikki, we need some wheels. Nico, man, excuse me, but I gotta make this call to tell this guy we're barring his car. Stevie boy, how's tricks? No, oh, man, you, you can spot me. <laughs> yeah. For sure. All right, uh, listen, man. All right, listen, me. Me and my ice cold friend Nico gotta borrow your car. No, no, no. The other one. Oh, of course it'll be cool. What? It's outside? Great! Love you, man! He's fine with us taking it? We won't have an incident like the last time I got the car for you? No way, man! That, that was a one-time only, baby! Me and Stevie are tight! Okay, tighter than that! Tighter than... Shit, I was gonna say my hands, but I think you know that nothing's tighter than this shit! Yeah! Wanna feel? Thanks, but uh, I got my hands full. God, this is exactly the type of shit you and me should be doing. Cruising for bitches, destroying the town. You and me could be doing some serious damage, like like a nuclear bomb up in this shit. But, but, but a sexy bomb, you know? A bomb that only affects girls with D-cups, tight asses, blonde hair, no cellulite, and tan. Yeah. Right. Uh, I don't know if I get your meaning, but uh, we can hang out sometime. Sweet! We got a race to win! So, when we get there, will you be driving? No way, man! I'm just here to look good! Me and you are cruising together! That's how we roll! Passenger side, flexing the guns, scoping the chicks, flashing the bling, Pumping the sounds, riding shotgun, while my boy Nico pulls off some badass Red Army, pedal to the metal, skin of your teeth, burnt rubber moves. Am I right? Is that our style? Because I think that that is how we roll up in this shit. Man, I am fucking pumped today. Here we be. You ready to feel the G's? Whoa, the skin looks really rough, man. You had some help? A little, a little botulism special there? I like that, homie. You want a shot when we get back? I'm fine. Winners, baby! place for us. Intense! Intense! I fucking love you, man! Number one, good driving! How do I look? Pretty good, right? Yeah, pretty good. Take me back to my apartment, man! I'm feeling jacked, I wanna hit the weights, now! You know what, Nico? You can keep this car, you earned it. And 
I can't have my boy rolling in anything but serious, genetically different winter style, you know? I thought it belonged to Steve. Fuck Steve! You are the man, man! You are number one! You won this shit anyway! I'll give Steve the bitch! The bitch don't work too good. Don't worry about that. Brucey has the magic fingers. They only touch prime engines, hot models, no cellulite. Okay, VIP only, read my lips. I'm a winner, and when they touch, shit! They work some serious magic, bro! What is it that you do, Brucey? Are you a mechanic? I don't get it. I'm a businessman, an entrepreneur. I make shit happen. Sure, but you seem kind of legit. Why you need guys killed? Of course I'm legit. Have you seen my delts? That shit is as legitimate as it gets. What about these guys you need killed? Fuck, Nicky. You know Brucey. He's number one. It's lonely at the top. Sometimes the juice, it just takes control, okay? Red mist descends, and I need shit to happen to people. Are you talking about fucking roid rage? Is that why I killed those men? Oh, they were bad cats, Nikki. Maybe the juice meant I wasn't as uh, patient as I should have been. But you know, as a businessman, I can't let people get away with shit. I need to be firm. Look, Brucey, I like you, and I think we should hang out, but I don't want to work with you no more. I can't go around fucking people up because you've overdone it on the juice. Oh, all right, Nikki, man, I'm feeling you, okay? You don't want to let our business thing get in the way of our personal relationship. That's all good, man. Cool. Nikki, I feel like we really bonded back there. I'm close to you, man. You let me inside. You, you, you let your armor down, you know? We had a moment, man. Call me, and we'll hang. Sure we did. Smoking tonight. You're a man with taste. Visit us again soon. It's Nico Bellic. I'm here for an interview. Come in, I'll buzz you through. My son and his problems got me smoking like a Welcome to Goldberg, Ligner, and Scheister, sir. Mr. Bellic, welcome. I'll just see if Mr. Goldberg is available. Mr. Goldberg, Mr. Bellic has arrived for his interview. Okay, great. Uh, tell him to come through to my office. Would you please follow me, Mr. Bellick? Sure. Mr. Goldberg is such a saint. He teaches kids to swim, you know. He's just so warm and giving. All he cares about is making the world a better place. And boy, are you in trouble if you get in his way. 
I always get nervous before interviews. He's just in here. Don't be nervous. He doesn't fight. Hello, Nico. What's that short for, Nikolai? I'm looking for a man who can get jobs done right. Nikolai, I like your resume. You seem to be the sort of man who would go the extra distance. I just need to take another look. Get myself reacquainted with your experience. So, you're the sort of man who doesn't wait to get told what to do. A guy who looks at the world, sees problems, and tries to fix them? Sure. My problem is that people don't notice the decay in society. They leave the decay alone, and soon it's too late, so you have to pull the whole tooth. Yeah? I am the guy who goes around shaking people. For people... Standing up. Assertive move, right. I, I like a man who takes control. Get rid of the rotting flesh stuck in your teeth. Prevent decay. Mouthwash, you hear me? There's this cop. Good cop, but he thinks he's above the law. He's not. Baseball, the great American pastime. Well, we got a softball team in the office. Get sweaty together, build team spirit, you know. I'm going to crush him into dust. No one is above my judgment. You understand me? Where are the files for your case against McCreary? Shit, they're on my desk. I never hurt anyone. I wouldn't be here if you'd never hurt anyone. <laughs> you didn't see anything, okay? Here are the files. Great. Peace at last. I feel cleansed. You silenced Goldberg, too, right? I don't need to worry about him? He's done. Whoa, music to my ears. A weight has been lifted. Here's your payment. Nico, there's something you don't understand about me, bro. Definitely true. I, I know it all seems straightforward. What you see is what you get, okay? No, trust me. It seems pretty weird. But underneath these rock-hard abs and biceps of steel lurks the beast, bro. What? I'm a wild animal, man. I'm a raging torrent, bro. Sure. 
My English not so good. Can you keep it simple? I'm an animal on fire. A crazy local lunatic. But all I'm saying, man, don't unlock the forces you can't possibly understand. Capiche? I'll try not to. <laughs> We have two great acts coming up. First, the incredible Kleinman! Welcome. I am constantly asked, Kleinman, when did you discover you were magic? Have you ever used your powers for good? Like making cancer patients or nuclear warheads disappear. One man even asked me, can you make my masculinity disappear? But I am here to entertain you, not your by curious fantasies. I will now make my assistant float. I will defeat gravity. I will be the master of Isaac Newton! Now, arise! 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 Yes, there, there! Higher, higher, lower, higher, lower! Ah, yes, I can make this filthy woman fall under my dominion. Oh, arise, yes. Suck, Eat shit. <laughs> oh, oh, Laurel, Laurel. Oh, oh, Laurel. Oh, you're a quadriplegic. Oh, don't worry, everybody. Uh, she's probably only a paraplegic. Now let's hear it for Miss Bluesy Saint John. Welcome. Welcome to Mama's Little Show. Yeah. Yeah, play it, Al. Play it. Al's a fine piano player. Pre-recorded because his union got a little mouthy and greedy, so we sing to his CD now. But I still feel like he's here in spirit. I have a little song I want to share with you. It's about something that's happened to us all. No, no, I'm not talking about getting sandwiched by two Lebanese train porters in the caboose. No, I'm talking about losing your baby. You know, they get picked up by a stranger on the way to go to school, and then you grab a bottle of gin down from the dusty cupboard where you put it, and you wake up in the sterile belly of a spaceship, and a man comes over and looks like your father, and you realize that day your dad disappeared. He didn't leave your mom for the fat bitch at the gas station. He was abducted. And your captors put you down in a farm field late at night somewhere in Iowa. And they painted patterns in the corn. And the crickets are singing. And the cows baying in the distance. And your backside hurts something fierce from the probing. Woo! And the Holy Ghost is there too. Man, the Lord has a ghost. And there's a girl on a swing set you go push her off the swing. And you know what? We're all that little girl sometimes. Sometimes life pushes you off the swing or makes you a little girl, even when you're a little boy. Well, that's all I've got time for tonight. I love you all. Thank you so much. Good night. Miss Bluesy Saint John.
I'd rather work than my fucking delts. Can you give me a lift home, bro? with UMB. Let's hang out soon. We're winners, man. Fucking winners. Yeah. Test me, no road boy. No one can test me. See? Who's testing you? Them slibber, slabber Russian type, my youth. <laughs> yeah? Debt, everything, disrespect. Yo, road boy, let me tell you something right now. But come and have a drink milk, road boy. We never come up a court in a car. Right. Whatever you say. Yo, road boy, let me tell you something. You see, fish could keep their mouth closed. Them wouldn't get caught, road boy. Exactly. Tell you what, let's go hit those Russian fuckers right now. You know what, rude boy? Come here, we go deal with them boy there right now. Yo, Mayo, get to your vehicle. Calculating route. Please make a U-turn where... Take and I go Carlton Street, side. A Russian boy in my kind of big roster. They come from a corner thing coming on my city. And all of this are fucking road boy. I want my operation to run right. I don't want no Russian boy come tell me what to do. You see? Sure, bad man. Some Russians been up in my face as well. My youth, listen, you're right, just you, my youth. Jacob tell me about a long time. You're right, just you, my youth. You sound like a roster man. Where is Jacob? Why you tell me do him thing right now, you know, see? Catch up with him girl and thing. You know that youth. Him love him girl and thing. You know no? Yeah. The youth are grind my youth. The man a hustling youth. Big respect for him to that. Yo, road boy. This are the.
righteous youth, my youth. Them Russian boy cause me no more botheration, road boy. Respect you. Don't worry about it, man. Yo, road boy, I catch your own and thing, man. One love, Rasta. I'll take this. I meant to do that. Really horrible. Well, that's most of them gone. It is an ironic strike. Mrs. Faustin, it's nice to see you. I'm okay. You know, it's difficult. Yes, very difficult. I was uh, sorry to hear about your husband. <sighs> Were you? Maybe, unlike that treacherous rat to meet you. He and I are not friends. My husband was not perfect. Far from it. He was awful. A murdering, drug-addicted bully. In many ways, the world is better off without him. But now I am alone. Put the in your I'm mouth. a 
Sorry about that. And my daughter grows up without a father. She's learning a bitter lesson very early. Yes, it's bad. And now the money is gone, the house got repossessed, and we are living in a one-room apartment. The land my of opportunity. I'd rather be back in Russia. At least there, people don't pretend life has any pleasure. Do you need money? I need more than that. I need someone to Try come to and get the man me. to leave my daughter alone. I can see he is a slime ball. I think he is trying to turn her into a stripper, or even worse. What guy? Some slime ball hangs out on Dillon Street in Shuttler. I can't do much for you. But I will get this slime ball to leave your daughter alone. Nico, thank you. But please, no more killing. Ball. Why does every Russian in the city call me that? What do you want, shitface? I want you to stay away from Anna Faustin forever. Yeah? And I want a blowjob every morning for the rest of my life. But we don't all get what we want. In this case, I am going to get what I want. Oh. If you want to keep your... Oh. Mm. Oh. Shit! You got a crush on that bitch or something? While I'm at it, I might hit that Russian bitch's mother, too! Say goodbye to your looks, pal! That bitch! Uh. <laughs> Shit! You're serious? I'll stay away from her. You ever see Anna again? You're gonna be breathing through a tube for the rest of your life, slime ball! Sure, Ma, sure. <laughs> yeah, I've always been a good boy. You know me, Ma. Y yes, I'll make commissioner. No, I don't care about Packy. Listen, Ma, I I've got to go. Uh, love you, too. Good to see you. I'm sure. Uh, you know what's funny? But I see a lot of me in you. You know why? No. You know there's no good. And no evil. Just shades of fucking gray. Whatever. You make things 1% better, that's enough. That's our duty. If you say so. Oh, I do say so. I want to make things a bit better. By any means necessary. And you? What do you want? I want to get paid. Sure. Yeah, sure you do. So listen. I got something I need you to do. This is the last time. Of course. Some drug dealer is holed up in a tower block in East Holland. Now, this scumbag's been pushing drugs, pimping women, you name it, he's done it. I need him dealt with. Isn't that police work? <laughs> sure. <laughs> and the moon is made of cheese and the streets is paved with gold. Wake up! Excuse me? The guy's guilty as sin! He is sin! <laughs> but it'll take me a year to get the evidence. More, maybe. And maybe good men will get taken down by that <laughs> evidence. <laughs> maybe people make mistakes. But this guy is scum. How much? Oh, how much? Good money. Uh, two G's. 
Two. You mean five. <laughs> you know, if someone was to tell me you were some fresh off the boat killer with more balls than brains, I'd say he was about right. Uh, okay, you got a deal. Head on up to Vogue site and call me. Five G's. I'm outside the project. Where is he? Should be on the second floor. Keeps an eye on all his boys from up there. The guys you see are gonna be working for that scumbag in one way or another. Anyway, these projects all got the same layout. A staircase leading up on either side. Try to get off the ground floor before getting violent. Violent? Me? Yeah, you. Remember, you're doing a real service for the community by getting rid of this scumbag. Francis McCreary is the community now? You're starting to sound like your friend Manny. Clarence anymore. You did a good thing, Nico. That boy was mean. He 
had a tongue on him, too. Always talking his way out of court, willing to compromise anyone to get out of trouble. Thank God for real justice. Huh? Hey, how you doing? Uh, good. How are you? Well, I'm shit, to be perfectly frank, buddy. Fucking shit. What? Terrible. Oh. What's wrong with you? Me? My life's a fucking train wreck. I cannot believe this is happening to me. Bitch! 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 Hey, come on, calm down. Fucking bitch! Who are you talking about? Who's this bitch? My fucking whore of a fucking wife, that's who! Okay. What did she do? Uh, my lovely bride, the mother of my son, is up there right now, fucking some prick behind my back. And after all I've done for that tramp, whore, ah! Hey, you okay? Hey, come on, calm down. You're going to do yourself some serious damage if you keep going on like that. Yeah, it's only angina. Come on, Jeff. Be calm. Jeff, be cool. Come on, champ. You can do this. Be a winner. Hey, ah. mister. You okay? No, I'm a winner. I can do anything. Great. See you later. Hey, you know, you could do me a favor here. <laughs> you know. What? Take some photos. Text them to me. <laughs> you want me to text you photos of your own wife? Hey, I'll pay, buddy. I've got a black card. <laughs> I'm afraid I only take cash. I'll give you cash, right? 500. Just follow them. Take some photos. Text them to me. Come on. Here they come. Here's my card. He gets so angry and jealous. I don't know what to do. Hey. Yeah? You know, I'm here for you whenever you need me. It's just that he gets so angry and jealous. I don't know what to do. I found bugs in my phone. I came home and my panty drawer was empty. Turned out he'd sent the contents to a lab for DNA analysis. It's not your fault. I trust you in his position. He wants to get a trackify chip put in the base of my spine. Says I wouldn't mind if I didn't have something to hide. Have I told you how beautiful your eyes are? I mean, it's Fuck, Fuck, sorry. I just made partner at my firm, asshole. <laughs> Bitch! The cum-guzzling bitch! She kisses our kid with that mouth. Ugh, I love her so much! Oh, calm, Jeff. Calm, be calm, calm down. Take your own advice, Jeff. Be calm. This doesn't necessarily mean she's cheating on you. 